Okay, so before we start animating, the first thing we need to do is make sure that you've got all the asset files that are required. So, if you have followed through my modeling tutorial, all you need to do is download the assets for an animated texture that we'll do later. So to do that, if you just click on the link in the description, which will be labeled nicely, it will take you to this link here, and it will say animated control panel .zip, and there's a folder. Click on this download icon there and download it and extract it. I'll show you where to put it in a second. Then you'll need to download the entire project file, including the images for the animated texture. And to do that, follow the link in the description again, and that will take you to this link here, the room project for animation. And so you'll click on this download link at the top of the page, and that will download. It's about 60, uh, 60 megabytes in total, um, and just put it somewhere you can find it. Once you have got it, so here I've got it in my Maya Projects folder. It should be called uh, Room Project for Animation. So if you have a look in there, this is what it is. Now, if you're one of the people that has done my modeling tutorial, then what I want you to do is extract the images that I've just told you to download and put them in the Source Images folder. And you can see there's a folder here called Animated Control Panel, and this contains all the images we need to create an animated texture later in the tutorial. If you downloaded the whole project file, then you don't need to do that because when you extract it, it's already in there. Okay, so once you've got all the assets you need, the next step is to get into Maya and to set the project before we move on. So here's Maya. I've got nothing going on at the moment. So the first thing I need to do is find and set the project so that Maya knows where to look for all the assets. So if I click on File and go to Set Project, it'll ask me where to look. So I'm going to go to Desktop. Maya project and I'm going to click on room project for animation and what I like to do is double click on this and when I see all these folders listed I know I'm in the right place and I'll just click on set and that now tells Maya that when it's looking for things like textures where on your computer to look and to test if it's worked successfully if you click on file and open scene it should take you to um, the scenes folder of the project so that will now take you to this file which I've called Room Complete. It might be called something different in the one you download, uh, but it also might be called Room Complete. You'll figure it out. Uh, and if you double click on that, it will open the scene that we're going to be working on. So there's the scene open, all the textures are working, and we're ready to animate. The next thing we do before we move on is make sure that the animation preferences are set properly so that we can do what we want to do within Maya. 